Hello, it's Johnny. I have two packages that just came in. Uh, this is for from the New Wave toys. And my first one is the charger. Now, I purchased all this on from my own money. I, I don't have enough uh, subscriber to be getting free stuff. So, if you could, if you guys would help my channel if you subscribe. Maybe in the future, they will start sending me free stuff as well. Uh, but apparently, all the stuff that I have is purchased from my own pocket. And I ordered this like a couple months ago. And they finally came. came. Uh, this one came first. The charger, the one that I got for the blue charger. This one. Uh, because I bought more more uh, one four scale arcade, I guess it's one. Is it one four or one six scale? And this is outside the box, and it say weigh about two point four pounds. It's a nineteen forty two one. Okay, and I think this is the the first version. I, I bought two of them. One is the. Now both of them have, I think I believe both of them have two games, but I bought, I bought the, the two. First. Let's go ahead and open this one first. Okay, uh, let me probably best bring it down. This is the they call I guess the change machine, and what this do is. We allow you to hook up multiple stuff. You could even charge your iPhone, iPad, you know, the smartphone. It's a USB connection, and mainly it's made for for RK uh, small RK cabinet. But you could also charge other stuff. So let me go ahead and get this power plug in first. Now, this device is not portable, meaning that after you charge it, you can now take it with you and able to charge the the other one. Uh, I don't believe so. I think you you have to constantly stay plugged in. It's very nice blue. Uh, I have one before the other one i got was the it was the brown color one and there was having a special sale so i said hey why not you know let me get the let me get the blue one this thing is like 50 some dollar it's very pretty and you have one fast charger and then one two three four five so total of six and it looked like a you know the change machine okay did they give us any coin let's see yep here's the menu and they gave you some gold coin gold color so instead of silver it's gold so that's pretty, real nice and pretty so it's a usb charging machine Let's see what kind of instruction they gave us. Number five, indicate the power. Let's see what it say. Number five, number five. Uh, this is a different language. So you got Spanish. Let's look at English. Number five is out of the service LED on and off button. Okay, that's the one on top. Number six is a quick charge USB 3.0 charging. So that that's the and the rest of them is just a 2.0 charging. All right. Did they give us any sticker this time? Let's see. Do we have any sticker? This look like a clear sticker. Oh, it's a dollar, dollar thing. It's very, it's white, so you can't really see it. 
But I bet if you put it in a blue background, you will able to see it better. So I think they're both the same, it's just white. In case you messed up one of them. So I guess I could peel it off and put it right in front of it. So I don't need none of this. I need my coin. Take the coin out. And let's close this one up. Oh, got one more thing. Yeah, put it like this. Let me go ahead and plug this power on. I guess it doesn't matter which way you plug in. You could plug it this way, you could plug it this way. Either way it work. So the power is on. And there's the coin. And believe it or not, we're sitting right on top of my pinball machine. So stay tuned for the next video on the pinball. I have a pinball machine at the bottom. And right now it's taking up the whole space. Let me make sure there's no dust on it. And we put it right underneath of it. Should be right in the middle. I guess right in the middle is good. I got a fingerprint. Alright, it's good. Now you can see better. Uh, it has coin, so coin, so dollar, I mean. Okay? Alright, I forgot the top. Now worry about that later. Okay, so that's the book for that, and there's the extra sticker. Let's open this bad boy. Alright, so I guess you have to open from <laughs> the size and figure it out. Uh, uh. Should be easy to figure it out how to open this, huh? Okay, you pull it up from here and you open it. Alright, so they have a box inside the box which is good because it protects your your console in case like uh, Amazon when they ship it they they, they just put it they don't why well, actually just ship like this but three box protection so it protect your artwork so that you know those of you who want to keep it I normally take them out and then leave them out I don't put them in a box there's a lot of box, okay. All right, so let's open this up. Let's look at the box, it's pretty nice. I think now I'm, I'm zooming in too close. Okay. Replicate, if I pronounce that right. Limited 11 inches display scale. RK machine. Licensed by Capcom and it comes with a controller and controller is 1943. I have a 1943 uh, RK cabinet is coming uh, but I can't resist the price. It was like uh, after sh shipping it's only a hundred oh nine. So I went and got this one as well. It's like why not? They both look different. The cabinet is built different and so I say hey you know might as well get it while it is cheap and so I'm gonna go ahead and open this up now I didn't buy extra controller which I could but it's only like a two button controller so I didn't get an extra controller because I bought two of this so so there is my extra controller I did bought extra controller for for the arcade for the Street Fighter I bought like three extra controllers, three or four, I don't remember now. 
Well, I bought it during the time it was regular price. It wasn't re it wasn't on sale or anything. So, uh, yep. New Wave Toys. I wonder what else they they are bringing out now. But FYI, just let you know, uh, this is this is not really a rumor. This is actually a true fact because they sent me an email asking me uh, would I be interesting if they built a pinball machine a mini version and I said I'll love it I will definitely order it so just FYI let you know that the new wave are working on the mini pinball machine which is really cool and uh, if, if they build the one like the, the same size I have a 10 inch screen that would be awesome because I am using a 10 inch screen and uh, with Android and I was able to uh, uh, put Zen pinball on it and and, and download uh, ooh it gave me two night oh because I have two game no no the game this is sorry this is the booklet so is the coin is a silver one and you have a sticker say top secret instruction oops sorry top secret instruction and then the silver coin right there the other one was gold and this one is silver okay so there's no special door on this new one you cannot open it so I, there's no place to put all this the coin where the older version they have a coin door where you can actually uh you know open it now it is too low well let me show you the top this is what it looked like this thing was right here and I just pulled it out and there you go and I don't know what this is here for oh the controller okay so here's the baby controller and here's the okay so let's get this thing out of the box and we could continue with the video Alright, come on. So let's put this back. Last time I forgot to put this back. Okay, there's nothing in there. That, that's about it. And let's take this out of the bit. Huh, I wonder if there's a cable for this. Oh, there is cable. Sorry, there is a cable, two cable. One for the console, one for the joystick. Don't forget that. Otherwise, you can't do nothing. Anything else in the bottom of this one? Nope, nothing in there. I don't think there's any special stuff underneath. Nope. So you do want to keep this box because in case in the future you want to give this away like your grandchild or you know like when we get old they you want to they want to sell this or or whatever it might be it's good to have a box okay there you go this is what it look like all right so we're gonna go ahead and peel the sticker off. This is my first time. I haven't watched other people's review yet, so I have no clue what's going on with this. But yes, and then I'm gonna um, peel this off as well. And then here's the joystick for two player. There's a plug, I think there's a slack and stop because here's a select and stop so which is good because in the past they didn't have that and this is a I don't know I don't know there's a two button here we're gonna figure out what that is and then we're going to put the joystick and everything together all right I'm gonna plug all this in uh, let's check the artwork let's talk about it there's the artwork it's very nice it's like a I think it's just a tape on. Uh, the wood is 
I don't know this is the original what it looked like because I never played this when I was young. I mean, I just play it when it was in arcade mode. But I never really, what is this white? <sighs> kind of dirty stuff, okay. But they make this, uh, the new wave toys, they make their product very nice. You know, as nice as the numbskull one. But I like this one. Uh, this is a screen of a four point, uh, four point five. It's not five inches. I think it's the same size as uh, as my iPhone four. Just I think it's three point. Maybe it's three point. We're gonna measure and see what size they're guessing. Okay. Okay. I'm going to uh, peel this off because I think this is the only place you could put this sticker. They have a special top secret instruction. So I'm going to put this top secret instruction over here. Ah, it doesn't look like it's supposed to be there. It looks it look like it's too big. But I assume that it's, it's just that it's too big to... Hmm. I'm not really sure where to put this. If I put it here, they did not tell you where to put this. All right, I'm just gonna put it in the front. Top secret something, fly over bomb or tent. You guys tell me where should I put this. I don't know. If you know, you guys know, let me know. I'm just gonna put it right there. Okay, and I already plug it in. Uh, it looks like it also support the uh, HDMI. So I'm gonna. I already have the HDMI in the back plug in already. So I'm gonna go ahead and peel this off. And. I don't know if you're using a mini HDMI or standard HDMI, so I got both cable with me. Okay, it looks like a, reg a regular standard HDMI. I'm gonna put this on top, might as well. I don't know why you cover it, but if you go into the people use it, okay. So I have the uh, HDMI. The cable is very short. Now there's two cable. This one is uh, this one is six foot long. Okay, this is for the joystick. The three feet one I use it for the power. So I plug the power directly in. All right. So let's go ahead. Press up for rocker button to add coin. Press down is for the menu. So let's go ahead and turn this on. Uh, my is the 333 there's only 5,000 that they are making okay so mine is a number uh, 3,333 my the one that this one came out and let's turn the volume up all the way up let's press the power on and this is a HDMI I have a plug into port 1 I don't know if this is port 1 or this is port 1 but I will find out soon all right, so I got joystick plug in. Uh, marquee a little up, as you can see, and this is the top view, uh, player one, and fire and loop, and uh, joystick doesn't click, button does not click. So far, I'm not hearing no sound. I thought I turned the sound up. Okay, it's just displaying the demo. Well, since it's displaying the demo, let's check out the screen. Okay, front view is good. The up is good. Uh, the side view, it looks fine. And this angle is good too. 
and so the all angle is good so this is a very nice uh, screen you know not like uh, the ORK one of where you have issue with the screen I can't believe that that those things have issue with screen all right so the insert file does not work until you push the button up here so you have press the button here now I'm having a shadow on the screen we're gonna press the button here okay and one more so now okay press either one player or two player I'm gonna press one player here. Play very nice. Oh, that's what I get by tilting the screen. The mark here look the light is very nice. It's evenly, evenly spread out. Okay. Let's see if we could go to the menu, okay? Game selection, because I want to know if I could select a different game. Yeah, there you go. Okay, so I want to play the 1943 one. So I press uh, the fire button. Oh, okay, fire button, 1943. Okay, this is 1942 cabinet, now I'm playing 1943. So there's two games in here that you could play. All right, let's see what it sounds like. So you have to press the, the up button, insert a coin, and so it's like you put in coin in here, you know, insert in coin. This thing do not open up like the old one that it used to open up. Okay, so bring the screen up over here, plus one player and this one the uh, it should be a little bit different than the 1942 yeah the shooting sound is different I wish they put 1945 in here you know So if you hold the button, it will shoot. You don't have to keep on pushing the button. Which is good, because my finger is getting tired. Ah. I tried to press the button there, and got killed. Ah, let's see if it works on a big screen TV. This one is uh, it's a 10 inch screen. So it doesn't use the smaller one, so I'm unplugging this converter, okay? I'm using a regular jack. Oh wow! I wonder if I could tilt the screen. <laughs> It'd be nice if it automatically tilt, huh? But it doesn't tilt. 
so if you have like a special menu option I guess you could tilt it let's see if I could tilt it I think that's just a I don't think I could tilt it I don't think this one come with the option does it but anyway if you have a, a special setup I'm not gonna play with my screen because if you but it's it's real nice it, it looked the graphic look very very nice now let's see if I could use the, the controller that uh, this thing is now this once you plug it in the screen go black okay all right so let's see if we could make this go back here and this is the IPX screen that I normally use for uh, Raspberry Pi build stuff. So let's see if we could get this controller to work. Uh, what's the button? Okay, here's a button to insert the coin. You don't have to go and, and press it there. You press it here, insert. And I bet this is must be the menu option. Yep, that's the menu option. So that's pretty neat that they put that here. Okay, we're not going to do anything all right I just press the menu button again uh, to get out and this is a uh, insert coin now I'm gonna press uh, this button for player player one and um, let me see if I could turn if I could turn this sound up I think my sound is not turned up all the way oh well Oh, it's a two player now because uh, I have I plugged the, the, the button so it's a two player now so this one <laughs> this one is shooting too I don't think I could play two player but I'm doing it so yeah Sorry, I couldn't save you. They're killing you. Oh, I got, I got burned too. I'm bring you guys, bring you back down here. Oh, game is over. So you could play two player with uh two, one player there, one player here. Now, if I um, if I unplug and plug it to the top, would that make me only one player? Cause right now it's it's treated that one as a second player. I don't want to put any name. Fourth place. Alright, let's see if I just insert the coin. Oh, I have to insert the coin on top. One player only? Yeah, I just want one player. Two. One and two player. Oh, it's two player again. I really don't want to play two player. So I bet I must be the yellow one because I plug in the first one. No, I'm still red. I'm still the not red one. I'm not the yellow one. Even though I moved the joystick to the top, I'm still the red one. So how do I get out of the game? Can I just press the menu? Okay, difficulty, you could play it. Difficulty 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, easy. <laughs> Markia, you could turn it on and off. Let me zoom this better so you guys can see it. So you could turn the marquee on and off from here. So if I turn it off, uh, as you can see on this screen, uh, I got this thing too tight, can't turn it. 
let me zoom back out and then try again okay all right so the marquee is off so if I press it on again and marquee is back on off on okay and you could turn uh, player one switch on and off player one slash two switch press any action button okay so I guess you could let's go back to this screen I guess you could turn the two player option off okay so you could turn that why right now is it's actually off play a one slash two switch I'm not sure what that do let's turn it on scan line oh you could put a scan line on I don't want a scan line you could turn the scan line on or off and backlight what is a backlight press left and right to adjust oh I can't adjust it now because uh, I guess because I'm not in the console attract mode press left and right to adjust the audio audio okay backlight don't know what that do okay and they show you the battery light right now it's actually full so I could actually unplug it and play a portable. Oh, cool. Yeah, this is a portable and then you also could play on a big screen TV. So this is pretty cool. All right. Oh, I just turned the scan line on. Let's turn it off. Yeah, let's turn it on, see what it look like. And then let's press the menu button to get out. Oh, that's what it look like. Oh, now I'm, I am the the cream one before I was the red one huh oh the red one is gone now the other player is gone now hey scan line is actually pretty nice they did the scan line pretty nice I thought it would look bad but for this kind for this kind of game with scan line turn on it, it's not bad nope continue I guess player 2 is already dead I didn't press continue Alright, I finished the Okay, I need to stop playing this so I could put my RK1 up together before I have to go to work so I'm going to cut the video short, but yes, you could put this on the big screen TV, which I, I only put it on the 10, 10 inch screen. So, and it looked nice. The, the scan line looked nice. So if I press the second player in, player one, okay. And if I put player two, okay. So I could play two player now. That's pretty cool. All right, let's unplug this. And let's see what happened. So we're back here now. Oop. Sorry. So yeah, you have scan line on. So if I press player one, player, I have to insert the coin. So I'm gonna insert the coin. Put two player.
sky. Alright, that's pretty cool. Alright, thank you for watching. Talk to you later.